take. Yeah, man. Welcome back to it, you guys. It's time for some DIY, and today it's all about organization. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I enjoy a really well organized and neat space. And today, we're showing you some cool new ways on how you can make your space prettier, more functional, and just more beautiful and fun, right? Okay, so I have two people helping me today. What's your name? Amy. Okay, Amy. We're gonna be working with some crafty things. Are you kind of crafty and creative? Yeah. Okay, so you're gonna have fun. Yeah. Okay, cool. And we have? Zakira. Okay, Zakira, do you enjoy these type of things? I enjoy making things. Mm -hmm. yes. mm. So you keen? Yes. Okay, cool. So the first thing that we're making is actually a recycled stationery holder. This is the final product right here. Okay, so basically all we need for this um, are these empty tins or paint cans and you want to make sure that they're nice and smooth so that you don't hurt yourself, right? Okay, and then we're also going to use some wrapping paper and also some glue to make it prettier. Now, with the wrapping paper, you want to make sure you work with something that works with your room or something that expresses your personality, so it can be very beautiful. So let, let's actually get started. Amy, do you want to come on over to the side? You can do this one. So basically, what you need to do um, is grab your, your paint can and actually take the wrapping paper, measure it out and cut it, and then stick it all around the sides of um, your little can so that it can be all beautiful. Okay, so get to sticking, guys. <laughs> Is it hard? Do you need some help? Okay, cool. So let's place it out like that. Okay, so place some glue. And then I'm gonna roll it on over, just like that. Do you wanna stick it down properly? Okay, cool. So the, now that we have our cans decorated with our wrapping paper, all you need is your stationery that we have right here. And you can arrange them in whichever way works for your room or your desk situation. So as you can see here, I like this way where you actually organize it and have markers in one, you can have your pencils in one. So you just go ham on that, right? <laughs> okay, cool. Let's move on to our second piece of craft work. Um, we have our jewelry holder here. Now girls, can you agree with me that like keeping track of your jewelry is pretty hard, right? Yeah. Like, don't you find it annoying where you have one earring out of the pair? Yeah. Like, it's pretty annoying. And also your necklaces, don't you hate it when they get all tangled? Yes, especially those, the ones with a lot, the yeah. all-in-one, those yeah. are very difficult to get loose. And if they break, then it's like, life is over. <laughs> See, but in this instance, our lives will not be over because we have a solution. And we're going to be making our jewelry boards right here. Okay, this is what the final product is going to look like, you guys. So basically, all you need um, is this um, canvas right here. Now, your canvas can be bigger or um, depending on how much jewelry you're working with, right? And then also, you'll need the jewelry that you'll be organizing, as well as some pins um, that we'll use to hang up the necklaces. So basically, let's actually start with this one. Um, you can stick the pins in right like, like that, just to have... Um, holders for your necklaces. Do you want to go on and hang that? You can hang it in whichever way you like. So you just use it like this, as like something to hold it up. Do you want to help me? <laughs> this necklace has a mind of its own. It's pretty intense. Okay, so you just arrange it in a way that you like. And then you can actually come in, Zakir, with the earrings. You just hook them in, in whichever way you like. Like, if you want to make a little pattern so that it can actually look appealing, you know? So just hook in some of the earrings so that we can see what it's supposed to look like. Okay, so into the craft board, it, I mean, the canvas it goes. So right here, we have our final product. Now, you can either hang it up on your wall, you guys, or you can just have it leaning on your desk, you know? Just like that, upright. So it's a very beautiful way to keep track of all your jewelry and also keep things very organized, you guys. This is fun, actually. Do you guys think you'll be making some of these? Oh, definitely. Yeah. <laughs> okay, cool, man. Stationery. Yeah, man. Now that all of our stationery and our jewelry is organized, let's take a quick ad break. When we come back, we are talking hectic takeover. You're watching Hexic 99. We'll be right back. Nine, nine. Hectic. Nine, nine. Hectic.